Yeah, just come out within the last hour or so. Uh, the school district was claiming that Jackson County's limit of uh, 100 people or less at outdoor gatherings is arbitrary and it is confusing. Now, they had a hearing on a temporary restraining order trying to knock that down today, but Judge Corey Atkins ruled against the district move to drop that limit immediately. Now, both Blue Springs and Blue Springs South have football games tonight and normally thousands of, of fans attend those games. The district claimed it makes no sense that the school's theaters with a thousand person capacity could legally under the limits hold 500 people, but a football game outside could be limited to just 100. Lawyers for Jackson County's health department told Judge Atkins there was no immediate harm with those limits. Obviously, some parents disagree. There is no reason for the county to go into our school and threaten them with a 14 day quarantine when they've done nothing wrong but play a game in front of their friends and family. Now, that is a reference to one of the potential sanctions that the county was threatening the district against, including other ones like pulling their health uh, department license for concessions as well as well. Now, Blue Springs is hustling at this hour now to reallocate the tickets for these two football games tonight. Originally, they set them for 550 tickets each game. Now they're going to have to scale that back to 100 and uh, they're going to have a trial on this later this year, whether or not it's in time for save any part of the football season remains to be seen after the school district of Blue Springs loses an effort to strike down the Jackson County limitations on 100 people or less at outside gatherings so that they could have more people at their football games and other outside sports. Michael Mahoney, KMBC 9 News.